these are recently collected momachogs or fundalis heteroclitus, the um, common killifish ranging from Newfoundland all the way down to northern Florida. Uh, from, from pure fresh water, if there is such a thing as pure, but fresh water to brackish to salt water vis-a-vis -vis marine or even hyper saline um, bodies of water several times saltier than the sea uh, and they can survive quite well right now they're in fresh water maybe oh, it's just a smidgen of salt there and um, you have some freshwater plants with them some uh, coontail or hornwort and some myrophilium collected from the Hudson River, the Myrophilium. Hornwort was collected years ago from some undisclosed location. I just kept the plant growing. It's growing in all my tanks, all nine tanks. Growing well. So this fish eats just about any kind of fish food. I feed them premium flakes, pellets, frozen food. Get them in spawning condition. Then I'll lay out some spawning grass of three inches from the top. Let them spawn, lay their eggs, and then uh, I'll incubate their eggs for less than two weeks. Um, let them air dry in a special container. Not submerged, but just moist or damp. It's a very interesting fish. Very, very hardy can get quite colorful during the uh, breeding season which generally ranges from April to August I believe depending on the geographical range these are from the Hudson River estuary behind the BZAC Environmental Center run by Sarah Lawrence College